We begin the list with Levi Erickla, a junior out of Calumet High School. Calumet is number one in the state. Levi is the team leading scorer with eight goals and 13 assists. Next is Brett White from the west side of the state at East Kentwood High School. White is a returning Division I All-State forward from a season ago. We now go to Scott Cuthrell, senior forward out of Waterford Mott High School. Scott is leading the Kensington Lakes Athletic Association Conference in scoring 24 goals and 15 assists. Our first defenseman to make the list is Cameron Heath from the number one ranked team in Division Three, Cranbrook. Heath is a senior who has four goals and seven assists. James Nahikin, senior from Troy High School. James coming to high school hockey after playing in the juniors, leads the OAA Conference with 23 goals on the season. Next to A.J. Bradley, senior forward from Northville. Bradley returned to action last week after a concussion to score the game winner versus Livonia Stevenson. He's got 10 goals and 7 assists. Another defenseman making the list is Nolan Glukowski representing Detroit Catholic Central. A returning two-time Division I All-Stater, Nolan has 3 goals and 7 assists on the year. Staying in the Catholic League, Mackenzie McKecker out of Birmingham Brother Rice. Already committed to Michigan State, McKecker leads the MIHL in scoring 12 goals, 13 assists for the second ranked team in Division II. We head downriver and Tyler Grote out of Wyandotte Roosevelt High School. Grote had 42 goals in 2011 as Wyandotte captured the Division II hockey title against Brother Rice. Grote has 10 goals and 7 assists this season. And finally, our only goaltender to make the list, Blake Watala from Trenton. Blake was a netminder for the Trojans in 2010 when they won their third straight Division II state crown. Blake is off to a good 10-2 record this season with a 1.75 goals against average. Good luck to all the candidates. To vote for your favorite, go to statechamps.tv slash hockey. Vote as many times as you want with a valid email address, and you must verify the email before your vote can count. Winner of the High School Hockey Player of the Year will be announced at the end of the hockey season. Good luck to all the candidates.